Hey, it's Bill. Today we're gonna be doing a VR experience by the slow mo guys. Katana slicing. That sounds interesting. Okay. Hop into katana slicing. Hello, I'm Gav. I'm Dan. We're the slow mo guys. There's something I like about filming outdoors. You know, uncontrolled <laughs> environment. There's just some cows walking through the back of the shop today. That's nice. Look around, see if you can see the cows. Hopefully you can. You uh, might also see this katana. That's not for the cows. No. That is for these water bottles here. So one of our old classics is uh, you slitting through. It was about 10 water bottles, wasn't it? Well, okay, I managed it once. But yeah, I can, uh, I'm going to try and do it again and recreate that, uh, that swing where I managed to slice clean through 10 bottles. Now, when we first did it, we just used clear water. Okay. Yes. So this time, in order to make it a little bit more visually dynamic for our lovely 3D slow-mo, is cool. uh, each one a different colour? Perfect. Let's do it. So to make the 10 different really? colours, I've only actually got five different colours of food colouring and I've worked out how many drips of each colour we need to make to mix the colours and create a nice little gradient. So the first one is just going to be a single drop of red. Oh, it's like being at school. Yeah. yeah. Little experiments. One. Here we go. Bit of red. Three red. One. Okay. Two. Three. Oh, cool. Ooh. One, I accidentally did an extra yellow there. Naughty. One. An extra yellow? Yeah, into my orange. It's here. It's absolutely fine though. It's no good. It's clearly still orange. Are you putting the colours in first, then shaking it up? Uh, yeah. Oh, look how satisfying this is. This is fun. It's really good. All right, let's see what all these make. Oh, yeah, good. <laughs> Don't shake any without caps on. Good. Yeah, so you shouldn't shake any without caps. That's good, isn't it? There we go. Give that a cheeky shake. Say, I, I nailed all mine. I didn't do any extra drops. Okay, well, I did one extra drop in the orange, but no harm done, okay? Look at that. <laughs> you made Lucas aid. <laughs> I did. Oh, lovely. It's pretty good, isn't it? All right, how do you feel about slicing? Well, well I feel like we're going to be making a lot of purple and not very much pink. <laughs> <laughs> You'll always get purple. Yeah, I will pretty much always get purple, maybe up to blue, but it's actually pretty tricky to get through all ten. All right. Okay. Do it. We'll reframe. Come on. We'll set up the phantoms. All right. Hanging. Okie dokie. Colours are looking good. They are. You're looking a bit pale. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I got sun down yesterday, I'm still looking pale. <laughs> We've got the two phantoms here. One for each of your eyeballs. Your eyeballs today will be running at a thousand frames a second in 4K. A thousand yeah, frames a second. I'm gonna try and oh my slice God. them with this extremely sharp samurai sword here. Yep. And uh, you're going to go and stand way over there where you can't be swung out with a sword. Yeah, it's a, it seems to be a well-made sword, but just in case it flies out of the hilt, yep. I will be behind you. Okay. Perfect. Okay. okay. Here we go. He's over there. <laughs> go! You did it! Did I actually do all of them? Oh my god! You did it! Ooh, first time! You expect anything less these days, All ten dude. bottles! <laughs> One slice! Oh, stay away from the sword, B. Yeah. I haven't put it in the sheath yet. Hold on. Okay, you First come over. try! <laughs> Whoa! Look at that. Look how cleanly that's cut. It's left the water. That is cut so cleanly. That's like, that is not even a millimeter. Do you want to lap some up? What does oh blue, my god. What taste like? Well, let us know. It's got a blue tinge to it. Cheers. That's how sharp it is. It's literally just not even moved to the bottom of the bottle at all. That's amazing. And you didn't seem to splash anything towards camera. I didn't even get wet. <laughs> Banging. All right, do you want to see some phantom playback? I do. Yeah. Let's do it. I do. Concentration face looking good. Got that forearm of my right arm straight. Whoa! Swing, pretty much. You have no training with the katana, is that correct? No formal training. Whoa! <laughs> straight wow. through. Boom. How is that so clear? Well, maybe it, that was just the last pink one had the least. Uh, Holy! Oh. The colours look really cool, actually, don't they? Bloody cool. Although some of the colours, like on the last few bottles, just didn't come out. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
You have to start oh low. Oh my god. That looked so satisfying. That was excellent. Thank you. It was excellent. Very tidy. Um, so now, I've gone to HD resolution on the Phantom. So we're now 2,000 frames a second. So just right in here. Okay, so I'll make sure... Smoother. Try and make sure not to mess this up again. Yeah. Mess it up again? You haven't messed it up? No, but, I, okay, try to not mess it up again. Because I did not mess it up last time. I'm going to try and oh, do that again. Try to not mess it up yeah. again. Yeah. I didn't say try not to mess it up again. <laughs> did I? That was actually confusing. Are you ready? Uh, I'm ready, yes. Here they go. Did you literally just do it again? Did I get it again? You're just too good. Yeah, baby. Look at that! That was phenomenal. Did it all just like jump up and then just fall down again exactly where it was? That it's... one looked to me, to my eye, like it mixed a little bit more in the air. Oh! oh. Gleam in colours. I do love this. I don't know why we didn't put colours in last time. Oh my god. Just didn't think about it, did we? There we go. How close am I to the table? Oh, pretty close. Ooh. Just managed to take the top off of that last one. That oh, looks this coming in for sweet! That's a, that's a great I like the... Uh, the colours all mixing together there, yeah. in the middle especially. And then like the, the later on colours go away from camera and the first colours go towards the camera. That's crazy, you can actually see the stuff moving one way close to us and then moving the other way behind us. I wonder why that happened. It. Like, it, went, it like twisted, didn't it? Yeah, that's odd. Look at all those little coloured droplets. That's class. They're like mixing. That's great. Whoa. Good hit. Cheers, mate. Eagle-eyed viewers may have noticed that we've stopped our table for a bin <laughs> and, a, and, a, and a grill thing. And I'll tell you for why. So with uh, less bottles, now that we're using bigger fizzy bottles for a bigger pop, Ooh. we don't want the edge of the table sticking off the edge of frame. It causes, you know, edge violation. If we have nothing here, we can push the 3D a little bit more forward to be a bit more aggressive. And especially if you come through with your sword here and it's sort of coming out the front, Ooh. that'll be right up in your business on the on the phantom should look primo Ooh. we basically just used the bin because that's all we had oh my god and we just happened to have a bin it was the perfect size yeah exactly okay okay <laughs> don't much care for that cheese oh my god that got it like butter absolutely perfect did you glue them down <laughs> they didn't even budge that's the secret <laughs> oh my look god <laughs> I'm just actually surprised the purple one went anywhere. I was not. Okay, I've got to show just the, the cleanness of that cut. Look at that. That is so clean. Yeah, the secret is you have to come at it exactly perfect, otherwise, what flavour is it? Red flavour? <laughs> it's no good. <laughs> Put that one They're just not good, are they? <laughs> I wonder if you could do a Happy Gilmore. Ooh. What, with a katana? It's a running start. Whoa! It's just like jumping in my face. It's completely opaque because of the fizz, and then it will settle down and turn back into its other colour. Look how clean that was. That's my favourite one that we've got death wise in this video. <laughs> There's so many different layers there. Uh, black one like flying. spinning. Some are going away, some are going towards us. Look some at that. Going... Yeah, it's really cool. I think it's the fizz that helped it come towards the camera, maybe. Glory of having two cameras. What? What is this? Where's that come from, then? <laughs> yeah, you yeah. just plonk these five watermelons. Right? Well, here's the thing, Dan. You're too good. You've not been foiled by anything. Don't tell me they're going fruit ninja. like butter through each one we've done. And I thought, let's put an end to that. Right now. I shouldn't have opened my mouth, should I? <laughs> I this think it'll be bloody hard to go through all five of these. Nay, nay. They're gonna play Fruit Ninja um, in real life. This is gonna be tremendously hard compared to water bottles that are very thin and just full of water. These are thick, solid objects. I mean, I, I, I'm trying to place my bets on which melon will be safe. Literally katanaing five watermelons. Yeah. But I don't know whether you're gonna get stuck in the third, come up through the top, mm. or just come down and just knock these ones away it's unlikely that'll come down 
potentially get stuck. I've never tried to slice through anything this meaty before. Yeah. But I think what will happen is, depending on my entry angle to the melon, I might just skip straight up and go one, two, out, or potentially three. five this watermelons. Will determine the fate. One katana. The mate. It will be determined here. <laughs> That's where it will be determined. Ooh. All right. You feeling good? Uh, I'm feeling okay. Okay. All right. If my arm comes off and I twist up like that, then don't think that will happen. All right. Okay. Ready? Yep. And four clean. Four clean off. <laughs> Look at that! He's a demon at this! <laughs> Goodness, See no the fifth one. The fourth one, and the last one, sorry, I don't think I even touched it. That's a, a fly. Oh, That's yeah. some sort of wasp. Rogue 3D <laughs> wasp. Hopefully you don't get him on the way through. He's like, <laughs> this guy's about to slice these watermelons for me. Uh, like, I could borrow in, I'll just let this guy take care of it. Yeah, yeah. There you go. You're looking at the second one or third one? I think it's the third one I'm looking at. I was just concentrating on trying to slice at least three and then anything else was a bonus there. Oh, there's the concentration phase. Ugh. Look at how much we're really going for it there. Chop, oh, chop, oh. chop, wow. chop! Oh. oh, I see. So that was sort of the end of your swing. So yeah. as you were getting to the fifth, you were pulling the sword away, mm. causing just a glance. What is interesting is on that though is that each melon almost had a different line. It was like up one, down one, and it was sort of almost like a zigzag. Just play that again. Yeah, you can actually see your compensation. Whoa! Yeah, my leading arm, my, my left arm, is God. trying to keep the sword flat whilst he cuts the power. four in a row Very clean satisfying. off. I think that four is the limit, just because of the length of the sword. If it was a longer sword, maybe I'd be able to do five. We'll get you a longer sword next time. Okay. Well, it's nice to see that my skills haven't faded that much. Not at all. I think we got some really satisfying footage. And as a bonus, we've attracted some bees. Oh yeah, and flies. And flies. It's always nice to see um, previous things we've done in 3D, because it adds that little bit extra, doesn't it? Yeah, I feel like the third dimension is my favorite. I think the fourth is my least favorite. That's a rough one. <laughs> Makes you just a bit, a bit gray. Clearly not been good to me. <laughs> we've got some grays going on over there too. All right, well, I suppose to... Right, we've got to point out. Okay, all right, for that. Yeah. Hopefully you've also enjoyed that video. Make sure you check out the other slow-mo VR videos we've made and subscribe to us on YouTube as well, if you'd like. We'll hopefully see you in the next one. Yeah. Now let's eat. I'm going to slice up some watermelon. All right, I'll just get out of your way. Hehe. <laughs> I enjoyed that. That was cool, and... I hope you enjoyed. This is Will. Mm. Watching a video of uh, the slow mo guys. Katana slicing. Four watermelons clean off. <laughs> That's crazy. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. This was Will, and catch you next time.